All right, in 1866, Georges Leclanche, um, I, French, I don't know how to say it, but yeah, he, that's how he、uh, spelled his last name, Leclanche.、Uh, so invented a dry cell battery. Okay, or、uh, was it Leclanche cell? <laughs> so hard to say.、Um, used to、uh, power flashlight and portable radio. That's the the, the use at the time. This is 1866. Yeah, even before 1900. Wow, that's long back there.、Uh, it consists of again, it's a battery, just like galvanic cell. So it got to have a cat.、Uh, Uh, an anode, which is a、uh, where oxidation、uh, oxidation reaction occur, and then and a cathode where、um, ox- reduction reaction occur. Okay, the anode zinc is outside, which is like the the container. Yeah, the、uh, yeah zinc metal can serve as the anode, and there's an inner the where the reaction happened. The inner、uh, was it graphite rod? Graphite is just carbon. Okay, there's a mixture of carbon and manganese for oxide. That's an anode right here, all right. And between the anode and cathode, so zinc is outside.、Uh, manganese dioxide, dio-、uh, for oxide is inside. Okay, and between these two uh, um, cathode and anode,、um, there's a paste of ammonium chloride and zinc chloride. Those are a paste, so which is wet. That's the solution where、uh, reaction happen. Okay, so what happened is same thing. Zinc loses electron oxidation reaction.、Uh, manganese four oxide、uh, take the two electron and undergo reduction reaction, and it goes like the you can write anode cathode. I'm not gonna ask you to write it. So I just want to show you. Okay, but this reaction occur in an acidic solution. So ammonium ion. So ammo- ammonium is slightly acidic. All right. So works as well.、Uh, a dry cell. So、uh, he called it a dry cell, but a dry cell is not. Like a、uh, completely dried, the inside is still have a moist like a paste of ammonium chloride and zinc chloride, which is like not not completely dry, right? But it's much drier than a galvanic cell, which is wet. <laughs> so so we call it, they call this a dry cell. But the drawback of Leclanche cell is well, the reaction happen in、um, in acidic solution, the uh, which uh, prone to corrosion. Okay, so the that lead to the short shelf, uh, short life of the battery, and、um, so people modify like how to use like well the, if the acid make a short shelf life, can we do a base then? Okay, so in this case we have an alkali batteries. Have you heard the word alkali before? Base alkali, alkali earth metal. Remember that group one, group two. So we have hydroxide right there. Okay, so instead of using ammonium chloride as an elect- electrolyte, the alkali battery used、uh, either sodium hydroxide and、uh, potassium hydroxide. So that's an alkali metal. Okay. Oh, by the way, let me go back to one here real quick. So I forgot to tell you the paste ammonium chloride or zinc chloride. Ammonium chloride ser- also serves as uh, the uh, uh, salt bridge. Okay, that's a salt bridge. We also have、uh, have a salt bridge here, but we're not going to get to the detail. Anyway, so. So we instead of、uh, do the reaction in acidic solution, we do in a base solution now. And what happen is is result in a longer life of battery because、uh, base is not corrosive. Okay, and、uh, the alkali cell produce a higher and more stable voltage at one point five volt. Okay. Yep. So and up.、Uh, yep. And oh no no no. Yeah. So that we use battery. And as we know that as a battery being used, the amount of zinc. Or、uh, manganese dioxide are consumed. When one of them is run out, the battery is dead. Okay. So if we want to keep the using the battery, we need、uh, to replenish the reactant, which is zinc and manganese,、uh, manganese four oxide. But we can't do that with the alkali cell. But some others can. We call rechargeable batteries. Now, some of them can.、Uh, can we can. Re- we have a lot of rechargeable battery. For example, the battery in your laptop, the battery in your your your、uh, your, your watch nowadays, your phone. I mean, everything. A lot、uh, in your car, of course.、Uh, we have a lot of rechargeable battery. Ah,、uh, let's talk about rechargeable battery real quick. Okay, the first one we're gonna talk about is lithium-ion batteries. 